ready to fight. Mr. Curry in Manhattan and Mr. Flynn. He's a very good guy, really. Uh, Did you ever meet him? What? Have you ever met him? Have you met LaGuardia? Did I ever meet him? Yeah. Yes, everybody in New York City met, <laughs> met Mayor LaGuardia. Uh, he was always having um, all kinds of gatherings for people to come to, and uh, he wanted very much to be recognized as somebody who is not standoffish, right. just one of the folks, you know. Did that work? And and he was very good. He was a very good guy. Uh, was he living in, was that Gracie Mansion? Was that, that again. Was the mayor in Gracie Mansion then? On the Upper uh, East No, side? I, I, uh, uh, no. I don't think Gracie Mansion came until several years after yeah. he was sort of out of the picture. Uh, and I know that for sure because the mayor, who are we talking about? LaGuardia. Well, LaGuardia, he lived in the same house as, as uh, my grandmother. Okay. And <laughs> really, yeah. it's a ridiculous story. And they were very friendly, and they were always they greeted each other every morning, and so on, so on. And uh, that whole thing came to an end when. Uh, uh, the mayor, let me see if I've got this straight. The mayor one morning greeted not only this woman that he, he greeted her all the time, but that particular moment he happened to be along, she happened to be along with her uh, uh, maid. Mm -hmm. And she greeted first the lady who was she knew, and he greeted the maid in the same uh, intimate terms as as the as the mistress. Right. And the mistress was totally offended by this. <laughs> and he kept on saying for the next twenty years. What did I do? <laughs> there was a time when, when uh, there was a strike of the newspaper people, and so that they, I forget the terms, but they couldn't read the, the funnies to the people. Uh, because it would be breaking the strike. I'm not saying that right, but that's close enough. Uh, and and uh, so LaGuardia jumped into the crisis and he read the funny papers over the uh, over the uh, radio or. Did we have television then? I wasn't there. Oh. You tell me. I don't remember. Uh, but he he took to reading the funnies to everybody. Yeah. And uh, so that nobody would miss the funnies. And he was much revered for that. 